Chaplin alchemized his pain, turned it into art. Exquisite, timeless, healing art. Very few people know that the Tramp character's funny walk was because he had worn through the soles of his shoes. He was in pain and trying to avoid the blisters. Trying to stay off his feet. You know, with, without empathy like that, this character would never have existed. Without empathy, we won't either. And with modern times, he criticized capitalism without a conscience. And that's what we have now. We have capitalism without a conscience. He showed the common man being fed through gears of the brutal, dehumanizing industrial age. He took on the American right wing of his day, its worst evils, hatred of immigrants, contempt for the truth, greed, and the abuse of power. We are fighting those same evils today. In America, in the United Kingdom, across the globe. And we need to be clear, shamelessness is not and will never be a superpower. <laughs> it is the mark of a villain. Kidnapping children is not what great nations do. Almost half of America at this moment believes there is a sinister deep state diabolically plotting to what? Give them health care? <laughs> what is the sinister plan here? Sure, I can afford the miracle drug for le restless leg syndrome. <laughs> I should take the pills, I guess. <laughs> we in America are misinformed. Reality shows have warped our idea of what a hero is or what the truth is. So tonight, I'd like to dedicate this award to those who remind us of our virtues, who remind us of the truth, to Sir Charles Chaplin, who battled McCarthyism into exile, to Christopher Steele, who tried to pull a thorn out of the paw of an ungrateful beast, to Christine Blasey Ford, to Colin Kaepernick, 